obviously risks can go either way. You have to be present and paying attention to the obvious in order to know which way the tree is going to fall. It even gives you the opportunity on occasion to help determine which way it's going to fall. Nice option. But it's only going to happen if you have your head in the game, in the yellow zone. So what is the yellow zone? It's a state of heightened awareness of one's surroundings and the overall safety level they're in. Pretty simple. Ever had the hair stand up on the back of your neck in a public situation? Chances are you looked around and identified some kind of bad actor or less than optimal situation. If you hadn't been in the yellow zone, you wouldn't have noticed and may have had to pay the price. Not being aware of the wasp's nests when you're trimming the bushes can result in some wild arm-waving, amazing freestyle aerobics and painful consequences. The same is true of bad actors, the people who intend you harm. But don't forget the good actors that bring with them benefit and opportunity. They're both risks. You just need to be aware in order to deal with them appropriately. These risks will be quite obvious to you when you're in the yellow zone.